When you picture an albatross, you imagine a seabird effortlessly gliding over the ocean waves. Its nearly weightless flight reveals a secret, a precise wing movement that harnesses the wind's energy. But what if we could tap into this natural technique? By mimicking the albatross's wing morphing, we could revolutionize flight, reducing energy consumption, and transforming how we fly. At least that's what three researchers thought. Could we copy the albatross wing movement? They rolled up their sleeves and dove right into the challenge. After months of hard work and experimentation, they unveiled their discovery in a paper titled Effective Wing Morphing on Stability and Energy Harvesting in Albatross Dynamic Soaring. But let's take a moment to ask ourselves, why do we need to change the way we fly? Well, current UAV designs face a big problem in energy efficiency, with many systems struggling to capture wind energy. This impacts their operational range and endurance, forcing them to rely on additional fuel. This means that every mission, every flight, might come at a higher energy cost. At this point, the researchers turn to the humble albatross for inspiration. During a 13-day migration, an albatross can gather about 370 megajoules of wind energy, which is roughly like saving up to 11 liters of gasoline. Meanwhile, current UAV designs only capture about 200 joules of energy per dynamic soaring cycle. They started by creating a parametric wing model using video data to define the wing's shape. With they then performed computational fluid dynamics simulations to see how different wing shapes affected airflow. Then they evaluated the wing stability by analyzing the alignment of aerodynamic forces with the center of gravity. After developing several wing morphing configurations using their parametric model, the researchers put them to the test. The albatross inspired design configuration was able to reduce the drag coefficient by 7.75% compared to a fixed traditional wing. And after refining this design using flight trajectory optimization, they improved energy harvesting by about 48% per cycle and boosted overall flight endurance by roughly 13%. Now I think it's a really strong paper that shows a great proof of concept. That said, I would recommend the authors to better mimic the actual albatross wing by including the role of feathers. For example, consider how the feathers on an albatross help create a smooth, flexible surface that minimizes airflow disruptions along the wing. All right, and now the meme of the week. Thank you all for watching. Take care and be sure to check out our next video on the Seagull Drone.